This is the absolute fastest way to put text behind an object right in DaVinci Resolve using Magic Mask. If you guys are even a little bit lazy like me, you're gonna love this. We're gonna drop our video in our timeline right here. Next, we're gonna go over to our titles and we're gonna drag in Text Plus. Gives you a lot more control over parameters. I already have one set up here that I'm gonna use because I like the effects that I added to it. Once I scroll over, you'll see that the text is in front of the boys here. You don't want text in front of the boys. We wanna make it feel like it's part of the scenery. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna option and click on our original clip. We're gonna drag that up. When you option click, you only select the clip and not the audio itself. So this is where the magic happens. Our text disappeared. We're gonna go over to the color page. We're gonna select the last node on our node tree. We're gonna hit option S. Once we do this, we're gonna right click. We're gonna select add alpha output. We're gonna click the little blue box and we're gonna drag this over. Nothing happened, that's okay. Go to our S curve, no, we go to our magic mask curve, sorry about that, and we're gonna click and color in everything we want to be in the foreground in front of our text. So we're gonna color on the boys here, we're gonna go through, and in the new DaVinci Resolve in 20, you should be able to just click and this will happen for you, but being able to select intricately can come in really handy when there isn't a lot of contrast or colors are very similar, but it works very well. And there you'll see that the text is smoothly right behind our boys here. Now, faster does work very well. I'm gonna use better here because it provides a much smoother transition when there's different gradients and shading and things like that. So next we're gonna just gonna click the forward and backward where we're gonna trace every single frame for and after this frame that we're using as our keyframe. And just like that, We get text smoothly behind both of our subjects. The scenery feels a little bit more cohesive like it's part of the scene. Yeah, Magic Mac is just unreal. See you guys in the next one.